Well, we're getting ready for holiday weather. Uh, no snow, doubt. huh? Oh my gosh, yes. I mean, it, this is the time of year, you know, it's it's not uncommon for sure, but gosh, it is going to be another blustery day tomorrow. Right now, the air temperature has been hovering in the mid-30s all day. We're still at 36 degrees in Indianapolis, 36 in Bloomington, 37 in Bedford, but check out the wind chill. This is what it feels like right now, feeling like 26 degrees in Indianapolis, feeling like 27 in Kokomo, feeling like 29 in Columbus, and that is because we have this very brisk wind. It's still out of the southwest, but sustained at 16 miles per hour in Indy. That definitely gives a bite to the air. Now we're watching for this system that has been moving across the northern plain states. It's going to start diving down into the Great Lakes area, having impacts for us here at home. In fact, here's the model that we'll look at here as this low pressure system dives across the Great Lakes into central Indiana. It will bring us some waves of precipitation. So let's break it down here go hour by hour throughout the evening hours, maybe a few flurries or two, but the first disturbance starts to push in after midnight tonight, and this will be moving across the Indiana border as some snow showers could be a very wet snow, but we could see a little bit of accumulation, mainly on grassy surfaces. Notice the temperature will still be hovering above the freezing mark and the ground is still warm, so it's going to be a minute before we actually see any of this accumulating. However, it's not out of the question that we could see some of this accumulating early before sunrise and then a lot of it after the sun rises we'll see a lot of it melting but then as we go about seven o'clock in the morning we'll start to see those temperatures rising a bit we'll see a transition in the upper levels as well of allowing this snow to change over to a little bit of sleet and some rain so this will continue through the morning hours temperatures tomorrow morning fall into the upper 20s and low 30s as we go through sunday we're still going to have this low pressure system the second wave moving through, bringing this wintry mix into the area. So this is eight, nine o'clock in the morning. We'll still have some light precipitation with us. I think we'll likely see a little bit of flurry activity, perhaps some wet snowflakes out there as well. And then as the upper level continues to spin over the Great Lakes area, this is going to bring in some lake effect snow showers as well. And the better chance of that is going to be in north central Indiana, where again, we could see some light accumulation, mainly on grassy surfaces. But notice this is at 6 p.m. tomorrow night. So as those temperatures drop, we'll start to see a little bit of accumulation. The accumulation that we're talking about could be a trace amount to maybe a half an inch of snow by the time it's all said and done late tomorrow night. And again, we're going to see um, this really melting at times. We'll see a breezy, gusty wind tomorrow and temperatures are going to be blustery as well. Feeling like the mid 20s throughout the day tomorrow with a high of just 40 degrees. We're going to see gusts around 30 to 45 miles per hour. Hour. Better for Monday, but still very chilly for this time of year. 41, but notice we jump to 60 degrees on Tuesday, and then rain returns on Wednesday afternoon with a high of 62.